Hello, my invisible family. How are you guys doing today? I know you guys are blessed and highly favored. Well, once again, family, invisible family, welcome to my channel, The Invisible Chef T. I am not going to be long on this intro. If you are a new subscriber to this channel, thank you so much for subscribing. You are now Invisible Family. If you are a veteran, thank you. Thank you for holding out and supporting and staying longevity with the channel. We so appreciate you. But you know what? I'm so excited today and I want to say happy Valentine's Day to all the beautiful ladies all the beautiful moms everybody that's celebrating Valentine's Day you know what I just got off work today and I had my Valentine's Day all weekend but let me show you guys hold up hold up hold up I had to go to the grocery store and I just wanted to show you guys a little something of what I picked up that's all you know I wanted to try to continue to stay connected with you all but once again hey Valentine's Day is a day we celebrated and we still got to continue to move on. And I had a wonderful, beautiful Valentine's Day. And I appreciate my husband so much for looking out for the girl, for loving the girl, and just being who he is to me. I really, really appreciate that. So once again, you guys, I want to let y'all know, I just did a small grocery haul, okay? And I want to show you guys what I got. Okay, I found this Pure Leaf. Y'all see that? green tea i've never tried it but you know i'm a pure leaf gal so hey green tea i'm quite sure it's tasty because all the rest of them i like them all except for the unsweetened but everything else is delicious okay i went to costco's that's the only place i went i just had to get a couple groceries you guys because um i went to costco's and fam let me put y'all up here that store was a little empty. I ain't never been in Costco's and it's starting to get empty. I go into the different other stores. They are empty. I don't know what's going on. We do know we have a truck shortage. So you guys, don't wait till you get down to the bare minimum and get empty. I never really froze my meats. I always like to buy my meats fresh and cook them. But you know what? It's getting to a point where I just bought meat, some meat this week and I'm going to have to freeze it because it wasn't much left. So let me show you guys what I got. I got a couple little knickknacks here. I got the pure leaf, the green tea. I got some raisins. Let me show you guys. See the raisins? We love the chocolate raisins. And I'm eating a cough drop, guy. I got some, oh, we just love these. Uh, Kirtland uh, milk chocolate almonds. Ooh, so delicious when you got a sweet tooth. We just put them in a little cup and just chow down. I was running out of garlic salt. I don't use this much, but I wanted to make sure that um, I had some just in case I ever wanted to use it and I needed it because you guys, they seasonings, they were pretty low and Costco's usually is stocked up on seasonings, but I guess people's just buying stuff and stocking up. But I said, you know what? I'm going to start doing that again. So that was my garlic salt, Lori seasoning. And I got some McCormick guys. This is, um, parsley flakes i was running low but this is the mccormick gourmet um parsley flakes and you know what guys these um they had them on sale i think it was 3.99 for this big old container so if you're ever in costco's i think they're clearing them out they had a big sale today they were 3.99 and i thought that that was a really good price so i got about three of them guys three of three of the parsley mccormick parsley uh gourmet parsley flakes see check it out the other thing is you, you guys we love nuts in this house i got some mixed nuts the extra fancy mixed nuts it comes with the cashews the brazil nuts the almonds the pecans macadamia nuts my family loves this loves this loves this let's stack this up over here so we got that and we got the garlic so we got some more. These are unsalted pecans, 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 pecans. Um, these are U.S. the number one fancy halves. So these are delicious. I like putting them in the fruit, and I like just putting them in a little cup. And while I'm driving, while I'm at work, just chowing down on them. We like those. We like those. And another thing, so I I just got a little bit. Okay, so this is the little bit that I got. 
from Costco's, not a lot. I go and just make sure that I'm not low, guys. So I've been, you know, trying to um trying to stay where I'm not empty. You know, you guys probably see the little barrels and stuff that I I packed up, but you know, that's just an extra food, extra canned goods, just in case power go out. You could just open up the can. I don't know, eat it, I guess. But I got some meats, guys. I'm going to show you this. I got some, I had a lady who told me, a friend, that told me that these were very good. And I know anything organic, the meats are very, very good. I'm going to show you. It is hatched, hatched, raised, and harvested in the USA. I like that. I like a lot of stuff that's made here. That's a that's a point for me. That's a goal for me. And these are organic party wings. And you just have the little sections. I know I don't know if you guys buy these, but you just tear off a section. Tear off a section. I think I'm gonna tear off a section in the fridge and probably cook them tomorrow. And um freeze them because you know i we're not gonna eat all of this we're, we're not gonna eat all this but i'm gonna have to freeze because i told you guys they were pretty short on meats i think they had about maybe four of these left you know and i know you see the price twenty dollars sixty seven cent but you're getting three four packs of you know the chicken party wings so i thought that was a good deal i like it i like the hatch raised and the harvest in the usa and I like it, so I bought it. So the next thing I got, guys, you know I'm at work, so when I'm when I come from work, I'll be tired. So this is the beef chuck short ribs. Y'all don't look at the price, because again, this is what I like. USDA choice. That's the kind of meat that I like. If I'm gonna eat meat, I I, I like to eat it organic or I like to get the USDA choice. That's just my preference, you know, for me and my family. So these are the beef. They are called the beef chuck short ribs, boneless. So I, I'm going to put these with some probably uh, some onions, some bell peppers, uh, season it up, chop them in cubes, and put them on top of some rice, y'all, some white rice. That's going to be delicious. I might do brown rice, grain rice. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, the next thing I bought, you guys, is some steaks. I got some steaks. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna package these. I got some um some freezer bags. I told you guys I have to go, I have to do the freezer because the meats are running low. And this is I love the ribeye. My family loves the ribeye or the filet mignon. Y'all, they didn't have any filet mignon, they were all out. So it was like maybe two more packages of these ribeyes. So I'm gonna get these. Take a couple out, marinate them, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to freeze these. And if you notice, the USDA choice, I always have these on my meat. I don't buy meat if it doesn't say that. And again, that's because that's what I like, what the label represents, and I like it to feed my family. And that's just my choice of meat that I like. And another thing I got, guys, was I got some shrimp. And these shrimp... They were the white shrimp farm raised. And um, again, all I have to do is just peel them, clean them. You know, I know they're cleaned on one side, but you got to clean both sides of your shrimp. You know, some people don't know that it's another strip on one side. It's a strip of whatever in the front. It's a strip of whatever in the back. So you got to clean that and you got to peel it and you got to clean both sides before you cook it. So I'm going to put all of this right here, fam. And I'm going to show y'all. This is my meat that I got. I went to go get some catfish, y'all. They were all out. They said they probably won't have any catfish for the next two weeks. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to call another Costco's and maybe see if they got some tomorrow so I can go get a couple packs and freeze it. But the guy said they just did not have any more catfish. They might not get any more in for a couple of weeks. So... Uh, what I want y'all to do is come and talk to me. Oh, I really want to talk to y'all. Can y'all talk to me? Oh, just come in the comment box. Come and talk to me. I really want to talk to y'all. Can y'all talk to me? Oh, just come in the comment box. 
Sometimes I know y'all tired, like me getting off work, but all I want y'all to do is just say, hello, how you doing? God bless. Um, watching you here. I'm supporting. And that's all you have to say. And I will so appreciate it, you guys. I definitely need the love and support. I'm looking for it. I appreciate it every single day. I appreciate you guys so much. But once again, I just want to show y'all what I got. I got a little small haul. I'm going to move this over here so y'all can see everything. I got a little small haul. Connect that up. Y'all, my hubby, hope that he tired. He just got off work and he snore. If y'all hear something, just don't worry about it. He is nice and tired and knocked out. But anyway, this is just a little small stuff I got. And then this is some of my meats that I got. My organic chicken, my uh, ribeyes, not my short ribs. And my ribeyes are right here. And my shrimp right here. So let me turn them this way so we can see them. And that's all I got, guys. I just wanted to come to you guys and show you what I bought, show you what I got. Hold on. Hold on so you can get it again. I got the chicken, the, the organic party wings. I got the beef chuck short ribs. I got the ribeyes. And I got the shrimp. The shrimp. So once again, I want to thank y'all for tuning in to me, the Invisible Chef T. Make sure y'all like, y'all share, y'all subscribe, and comment on this video. Once again, I'm not doing nothing much. It's just a small grocery haul. Thank y'all for tuning in. Thank y'all for supporting. Just binge my my channel once again i am gonna probably be doing some lives but i won't do that until i'm in my new kitchen for sure but we're gonna be monetized soon and i just thank y'all and i'm working hard and i'm not expecting nobody to do nothing for me um and, and get nothing done for free i know that you have to work for it but i do appreciate support and so i'm asking for support because at the end of the day you definitely got to do what's good for you you definitely have to hype your own channel up you definitely have to do your own thing with your channel because at the end of the day ain't nobody gonna do it for you but you so i'm not expecting nobody to um help me far as like do more than me for my channel or help or, or just give me my watch hours and i do nothing no i hey this is my channel and i always been a business woman i always believe in uh hustling and 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 working hard and 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 you know doing what I need to do to, to go to the next level. And that's what I'm going to do. And I appreciate the support. So I definitely, you need support. And, and if anybody say they don't, they lying. So I definitely appreciate the Invisible Chef T family. I appreciate all the subscribers, the new subscribers. Thank you all so much. I got to go, y'all. Y'all be blessed. Y'all be safe out there in these streets. Okay? I love y'all. Stay prayed up. Peace. Peace.